I have a Discord now. Join it. Yo, what's up? It's your boy KSI. How are we all doing? Uh, today's a Reddit day, obviously. I'm still in camp, still training. You're probably wondering, how do I have the time to still do videos? Best believe, training is very hard, okay? Camp is very hard. I'm training twice a day and all this and all that. But I guess beforehand, I did so much more compared to how much I do now, if that makes sense. Now all I need to do is focus on me training. That's pretty much it. <laughs> So I see camp as a holiday. It's weird. Anyway, be sure to get your tickets down below to see me knock out Alex Wasabi and see all the other fights. It's gonna be an insane event. Obviously, my event is the only event that's happening. <laughs> but anyway, be sure to get your tickets down below to see the best event happening uh, on August 27th. Also, your boy has got his new song with Tom Grennan. Not over yet this Friday, ladies and gentlemen. The music video will blow your mind. I am so excited to do reactions of the reactions of my music video because people are gonna be like, what the fuck is this? Like we got we got some boxing content. Also at the end of the music video, we do a madness. Like let's just say everything comes together nicely and it's it's exciting, very exciting. Um, yeah, this Friday it's coming out. Be sure to uh, get your pre-orders down below. Pre-order the song, pre-order it down below. And uh, yeah, let's see what the Reddit is saying. Agreed. Uh, sides plus Prime plus Sidemen Sunday. Incredible evening. It's yes. Like, mm, best believe after camp, your boy is going in on sides, man. I'm going in. It was so painful having to watch everyone eat sides during Sidemen shoots. And I'm just there like, oh, I have to just nibble here or nibble there. Like I wasn't able to indulge after camp, after I win that fight. Woo! Your boy's munching. Give me them sides, baby. Guinness World Record. What? Unreal Sidemen Sunday this week, my guy. That's so random. Why? <laughs> I don't understand how all these like brands now just have Twitter and talk like normal people. <laughs> it used to be so corporate. Now they're just like, sick Sidemen Sunday, bruv. Who are you? <laughs> what are you doing? Nah, Sidemen Tinder was better when it was normal girls getting shocked by the Sidemen pickup lines instead of a bunch of OF <laughs> girls getting their tits out for a side plus advert. Damn. I mean, you're not wrong. I mean, <laughs> I honestly, honestly, I wasn't expecting what I was expecting. The girls were very open. <laughs> and yeah, let's just say if you're a side plus member, you got a lot more than you bargained for. <laughs> It was a big dub for you guys. Honestly, I don't think we'll be able to do another Simon Tinder anyway. I don't know how we would top that. How are we gonna top girls showing their tits? <laughs> how are we gonna top that? And you know, we had Logan Paul in it. George was amazing on it. Uh, Mike was funny. You know, all the boys were funny. Like it was top tier and it did the best. Like over 10 million views in 24 hours. How many views is it on now actually? Let me give it a look. 22 million. Oh my God. 22 million. I know some people maybe got annoyed at that fact, but at the end of the day, it's a video. It's, you know, it's for entertainment purposes. As long as you're entertained, then cool. Like, either way, 22 million views says a lot, man. <laughs> this was the worst face to face that I've seen in my life. Oh God. Okay, here we go. Jesus. This was the worst face to face that I've seen in my life. I appreciate JJ a lot. And it's great that he's confident for his fight. But Jesus, the face-to-face -face just started and JJ goes on a five-minute rant. Bro, I was pumped. Some people thought I, I took coke beforehand. Imagine if I did take coke, bro. I'd be off the fucking chain, man. I think because I was finally face-to-face -face and I could finally directly speak to him. Whereas before, like, I've been trying to get in contact with him or be face-to-face -face when I was in America and he just wasn't having any of it. So I was, it was pissing me off. Literally, the whole video was JJ being the least humble person ever and constantly being me, me, me and didn't even let Alex answer any question properly. Uh, I can tell you're a new fan. <laughs> Bro, when it comes to boxing, this is me. Like normally I'm very humble. I'm a very humble person. That's just me. Whenever I'm fighting someone, well, I'm not gonna be humble. <laughs> I have another man who wants to beat me and take away everything that I've worked for. My whole legacy, he wants to ruin it. He wants to destroy it. I'm not gonna let that happen. <laughs> 
So I'm going to be cocky. I'm going to be super confident. I'm going to be me, me, me. And I'm not going to be humble about it. <laughs> it's just simple as that. This was exactly how Logan was behaving in all those press conferences. But I was the exact same as well. We were both clashing, clashing with each other. Um, before the second fight, Logan wasn't humble at all. Constantly interrupting JJ saying he would decapitate JJ. I did the exact same thing when it was a press conference in the UK. That was just me, bro. I gave him no time to speak. And now JJ's doing the exact same thing. Bro, JJ, good luck in the fight. And we'll always support you, but calm the fuck down. No, man. The fuck? Why would I be calm? Guys, come on, bro. Holy shit. You want me to be like, yeah, I'm going to be him. Yeah, yeah. Guys, I've worked harder than I've ever worked in my fucking life. Harder than the Joe Weller fight. Harder than the first Logan fight. Harder than the second Logan fight. I put 110% into this. And you want me to be humble. You want me to be just like, yeah, you know, I'm just going to get in the ring and do my thing. No, man. I'm going to tell him everything I'm going to do. And I'm going to fuck him up. <laughs> and I'm going to laugh at him in his face while I'm doing it. It was 30 minutes of JJ saying, you don't know what's coming for you, Alex. You're fucked. Because I don't think he does. I don't think he understands. He thinks I'm coming and swinging, bro. I'm not. I swear, this is so interesting that a lot of you are like, oh, why are you being like cocky or da 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 da? I feel like people have always seen this. I've always been like this. <laughs> Nothing's changed. KSI versus Alex Wasabi leaked. Go Charlie, it's your birthday. We're going to party like it's your birthday. We're going to sit on top like it's your birthday. And you know we don't give up. Yeah, no, I just don't see Alex Wasabi having the power to knock me out. He said that he'd been knocked down before. I thought that was very interesting that he just openly said that. I thought he wouldn't uh, admit that. So fair play, you know, I gotta give him some props for that. But yeah, it's it's gonna be a long day for you, Alex. I'm going to drown you. It's going to be a nightmare. Prime X Arsenal, W or L? What do you mean W or L? It's a fucking W. Obviously, if you're a Tottenham fan, then it's an L, but fuck you. <laughs> Massive W for JJ so proud. Ah, uh, guys, thank you. Yeah, bro, this is huge for me, man. I can't believe it. Legit a childhood dream of mine. I I just but I can't even speak. <laughs> I can't even speak. Look, Arsenal are primed, fam. They're hydrated. They're they're smashing it. We beat Sevilla 6-0, fam. It's dream come true, man. Dream come true. It's so sick. Uh so what's it going to be? Well, it was the Arsenal uh Prime announcement but i'm intrigued to know what you lot thought it could be this got i'm about to shock the world vibes oh i'm tweeting that before my fight best believe i'll probably tweet up day of my fight i'm here to fuck up this curse watch watch logan built for this oh mate logan smashed SummerSlam. smashed it he did so fucking well bro he's it just seems so He's in an actual fight. Natural. Bro, look at this. What the fuck? Bro, no, 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 no. Can we understand what the fuck is just happening right now? He's at SummerSlam, the biggest stage, bro, of the WWE. And he's out here just somersaulting The Miz. <laughs> My man's just backflipping onto The Miz. What? Great clothesline. Great body slam. Boom. Wow. Great crossbody. And again, just flips onto him. Great, great flying elbow. And then this. Oh my god, bro. Jesus Christ. Nah, bro. Levels. Levels, bro. It's levels. It's levels. Top notch, man. Top notch. So sick. Whoa, even Kanye agrees. There should be a new system where we submit the videos, and if you laugh, the person who submitted the video gets the money. Ooh, that's a good idea. That's a very good idea. I don't know how we would do this. But not on this subreddit, he would make a new one, because otherwise, people are going to start flooding this one with memes and videos, which will cover this. Oh, good point. Very good point. Okay. All right. Mo, let's figure this out, how we can do this. Um, once we get to $1,000 per laugh, after that video, let's see if we can do this. This is a good idea. Sure, it's his money, but come on. Me watching JJ throw away money that can pay my monthly living expenses every time he giggles at TikTok. <laughs> 
Oh, man. <laughs> God, you're going to hate the 1,000 one then. Jesus Christ. <laughs> bro is contemplating his life decisions. Bro, I was on his ass, man. I'm called the nightmare for a reason because Facts. I will drown you. Uh -huh. I will make you suffer, uh -huh. okay? I will be in your head. Bro, he, it, he looks over, like he's over. already over it. <laughs> He's already there like, oh, fuck, maybe this isn't a good idea. But then he's looking at the bag that he's getting, and he's like, oh, actually, maybe. <laughs> I will be in your head over and over and over again. Even after the fight, I will be in your fucking dreams. And uh, I'll be scaring the shit out of you. You'll wake up like, oh, my God. Oh, my God. I, I just had a dream that I lost. Oh, wait, I did. Every day. Every day, bro. And then I'm going to be there. Laughing at wasabi. Fucking hell, man. Pause. Oh, what is this? The touching thing. <laughs> Fusi said he was gonna touch. <laughs> Deji, like he's never touched anyone before. I'm like. But I don't think Deji's ever been touched in the way that I'm gonna touch him. Jesus. Um, you review all his fights. Fusi, chill, bro. <laughs> he probably regrets choosing Talia over JJ. Holy, this is insane. KSI's ex reacts to Prime X Arsenal tier. Bears has been kicked out, bro. Faith versus me. I, I, this is all blessed now, but yeah. The back and forth was, uh, was, was intense. <laughs> I didn't really understand the chair thing. I get it now because Ethan said he got stuck. So I guess that's her being like, there's no chair for Ethan to get stuck on. Me and Mark Over came on through with this. Stop. Like, all right, move the chair. Doesn't matter. I'm still gonna just sit on your ass. Look, I'm sure Faith's hormones are through the roof. She's currently pregnant. And I'm sure she doesn't actually fucking mean everything that she's saying. Yeah, like, it's one of those things where it was just a bit of back and forth. JJ, whenever YouTubers are challenging him. There we go. I'm not just like the rest of you. I'm stronger. <laughs> I'm smarter. I'm better. I'm better. <laughs> I am better. Oh, bro. You need to watch The Boys. If you haven't watched The Boys, oh my God. The best Amazon video series ever. So good, so good, man, so good. I finished season three and I'm just there like, please, I need more. <laughs> Give me season four. I don't know how they managed to just make it better each season, bro. Oh no, JJ making fun of cerebral palsy kid from Family Guy. All the fans with cerebral palsy watching him. Uh, don't, don't do that. Okay, yeah. Okay. Look, 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 it's... Don't do that. For God's sake, man. For God's sake. What's this? I made a 3D animated Prime Ice Pop commercial. What? Hey, <laughs> this gate red. I'm just on the wayside. There's Prime, nice and chilled. Oh. Oh! Oh my god. Oh my god. Mo, where was this guy when we were reviewing Prime advertisements? Ah, oh, he got everything right! Well, the colors, the, the, the music! Listen, listen to the drop. He got the drop perfect. Wait for it. When the Prime comes up, it drops so nicely. Boom! Shut up, man! There's levels to this! There's levels to this! Bro, nah, man, I need to give you an award, man. That was amazing. I'm about to give you a platinum as well, my G. Bro, you know what? I might give you two platinums. Here's another. Here's another. Here's another platinum for you, bro. Oh, you think we done? No, 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 no. Yeah, yet another. Net, yet another platinum! You know what? One more, just for good measure. Just for good measure. Platinum! Jesus Christ, that was insane. Big up Crystal Goat, man. That was so sick, bro. That was so sick. KSI is going to go hard on Alex. Why does that sound weirdly sexual? 
wake up and I'm just seeing Alex Wasabi and I'm just like, bro, I need to annihilate him. I just need, bro, oh, bro okay. you're just there every day. That's all I think about. That's all I think yeah. about. I just need you on the floor. I need you okay. annihilated. I need to. With that music, it sounds mad. <laughs> Imagine Alex just goes, yeah, what? You're going to fuck me hard, huh? You're going to fuck me, daddy? <laughs> oh, that would fuck me up, honestly. <laughs> what the fuck is this? What the fuck is this? I wonder how Deji's looking. Because his opponent, he's... This video is still... Oh, what, bro, this guy's a pussy. Yeah, bro, I'm so funny. Come on. I'm so much better than that other guy. Fuck this dude. Fuck the strange of things looking like <laughs> motherfucker. <laughs> Wait, is it? Why does KSI have to be so freaking mean? Is this him responding? <laughs> oh, wow. Okay, all right. Just kidding, KSI, you ugly looking scumbag. Oh, KSI, wow. Bud, you said that I'm a pussy. Uh-huh. Then I'll give you an offer. All right, I know I'm not big enough to fight you on the big stage. You're not. But whenever you're in LA, you can come fight me in my backyard. I have a whole boxing ring back there. Come fight me any day you want. In your oh, backyard. Do I look like Joe Weller? <laughs> I ain't falling for that one. <laughs> if we were gonna spar, bro, we're sparring at a neutral place. Or I'll fly you over and we can spar. Fucking hell. It should be illegal for you to take that bandana off. With a hairline like that, nobody should have to look at that. Look at this. This, this is what you look like, bud. You look like this guy? I kinda, to be honest, I kinda do look like him a little bit. Why do I low key do look like him? <laughs> you look like this guy. I definitely do not look like him. And you even look like this guy. Three ugly looking cunts. They all look just like you. Oh, wow. You fucking rat looking bitch. Wow. How are you going to feel after your brother Deji takes his fifth fucking loss to I'd, Fousey? I'd be... Big Foos. I'd be pretty pissed off. I can't lie, but it is what it is. It's on him. <laughs> if he trains hard enough, he could smoke anyone. Deji, after my boy Fousey beats your fucking ass... I like to take a run at you. Same offer that I gave to your brother. We can do it in my backyard. Why do you want us to be in your backyard so much? What's in your backyard, bro? <laughs> now, I don't know if you've noticed, but. Oh, I'm yeah. In my team, team Paul attire. Paul, cringe. Oh, you got the shorts as well. So cringe. I figured it was appropriate for this video. Surely you must feel like a dickhead. <laughs> Surely you're not there willingly happy to wear that. <laughs> Considering Jake Paul's your daddy. He just okay, isn't. When are you going to fight Jake? You said that I look like the guy from Stranger Things. The only strange thing that I've seen lately is uh -huh. your mother bouncing on my dick in a full split. That just well, hasn't <laughs> happened, but okay. Well, KSI, if you want me, nice. you know where to find me. Let's cut to the clip where I show them what I would do if we saw KSI out. All right, let's see your skills. Okay, let's see what you're gonna do. Oh. Oh, okay, nice. So you still needed someone to help you out. <laughs> You didn't even get the first punch in. This guy did. <laughs> wow. Look at those punches. Crazy. Wow. Yeah. Great. Look at those punches. Bro, you see that punch? <laughs> Crazy. Wow. He missed. Bro, he missed. He missed. He missed the punch. You missed. You missed it. One of the shots. Where is it? Look at that, you missed! <laughs> and then you fall on top of me! Fucking pussy! Wow. Crazy. Unbelievable. And. Fuck you, KSI. You're a bitch. You know, I'm a bitch. You know where to find me, bud. In my backyard. In your backyard. Always, always his backyard. What the fuck did I watch, man? Oh, but man's feelings got hurt. <laughs> this motherfucker. Who the fuck is that? Yeah, who the... I don't even know his name. Motherfucker Mrs. his punch. <laughs> Breaking news. Hasim Rahman Jr. pulled out of the fight. Well, he didn't actually pull out the fight. I'm pretty sure Jake Paul pulled out of the fight because Hasim didn't... Uh, enter the weight that Jake Paul wanted him to enter in. I guess JJ's tweet about Jake Paul versus Woodley 3 being on standby was right off the front. Woodley's just there like, hey, yo, what? Round three? <laughs> hey, yo, what? You need me? I can get ready in a week. <laughs> Jake Paul ain't fighting. What an L. All this hype for there to be nothing. It's crazy, though. It's gonna be Austin versus Gibb and Jake Paul versus Tommy Fury, both cancelled. And then now, Jake Paul versus 
Hasim cancelled. KSI versus Alex Wasabi is the only boxing YouTube event that's happening. Incredible. The <laughs> incredible scenes. I think there's a couple reasons why uh, Jake Paul versus Hasim Rahman didn't happen. First of all, I think I think Dana White mentioned something like this. Uh, they weren't selling. There were still lots of tickets to be sold. It costs a lot to put the lights on at the MSG. <laughs> I just don't think Jake Paul could afford to fight at the MSG. He just, bro, he doesn't have the clout like that. <laughs> he don't have the source like that. Especially to fight a nobody. For me, I can fight a nobody like Alex and sell out. <laughs> it's as simple as that. Bro, Jake Paul's out here charging $60. More than Usyk versus AJ. Do you know what you could do with $60? With $60, you could go to a nice restaurant. Go to the O2 to watch me annihilate Alex Wasabi. You could even buy my pay-per-view and still have money left over to buy snacks and drinks and whatever the fuck you want. You can literally buy Prime, buy sides, and watch the pay-per-view all in the comfort of your own home. Like it was crazy. Jake Paul was literally robbing his audience. And some of his audience would actually pay for it. That's the sad thing. Some poor souls. Spending money getting scammed by this guy fam. I can understand if it was a big fight you versus Tommy Fury fine $60 You know what a lot of people are gonna want to see that but you versus Hasim no <laughs> $60 no also to give Jake the benefit of the doubt I think Hasim was trying to play a fast one I think Hasim didn't give a fuck about the money. He just wanted to be that guy who beat Jake Paul. That guy who knocked out Jake Paul. And he wanted every advantage that he could get. Fair enough. You know, he tried it. End of the day, they both lost out because now they're both just sitting at home <laughs> with their dicks in their hands, making no money from the fight. Bro, you know what? Jake should have accepted my offer. He should have fought on my undercard. I mean, there's still time. You can fight Tommy Fury on my undercard. It'll be a great event. You'll be able to fight Tommy Fury in a sold out O2 arena. You won't have to worry about the logistics. We'll sort everything and it'll be easy for you. All you need to do is show up and that's it. Show up, weigh in, do a little press conference and that's it. But it is what it is, isn't it? <laughs> the Indians will fill this one. It's just amazing. Look at him. He is a bundle of joy. He brings so much happiness. Yeah, that fat son of a bitch. I don't give a fuck if I'm body shaming because he's fat as f <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> the best part of the new Simon Sunday. Hi. Uh, I'm George. Nice to meet you. You're 29. I uh -huh. hope you like candy. And if you do, come taste the rainbow. Oh. Said, Why is it always me that hurts? <laughs> you said yes to my girlfriend? Sweet. Are you okay about forgetting? I love when they've got to surely show the part where he gets stuck. All his dance moves as well. So sick. He was so sick, bro. Yeah, yeah. George carried the fuck out of this video, man. I mean, it was a good video anyway, but he just brought it to greatness. He was so sick, man. Big old George, man. He was so funny. Nice guy. You don't have what it takes to win a boxing fight. First of all, Deji, without a doubt, put in more work in this camp to get ready for this fight than he ever has before. He was in the best shape that anyone has seen him in. He put in the work. He lasted the entire fight and he showed heart through every bit of it. I believe that I fought the best Deji, the prime Deji. This is the best Deji has ever been. I don't know, I mean, Deji underestimated me too. He didn't put the work in. I think KSI is definitely gonna put the work in. <laughs> you played yourself. You played yourself. You played yourself. To get ready for this fight. Wow. It's so funny because he's managing to deceive a lot of people. He's portraying that. He's this really nice, happy guy that's just enjoying his time. But I think he's an absolute twat, bro. <laughs> I think it comes through every now and then. I just can't wait to get my hands on it, man. It's been so long. It's been years of back and forth. Years of back and forth. And now, finally, I get to silence this motherfucker bro silence him anyway anyway this has been your boy ksi uh it's not over yet it's coming out this friday big song i'm excited for you to hear it and uh yeah get your tickets down below o to arena ksi versus alif sasabi fusi versus deji and you ain't gonna want to miss it all right take care and peace